Hi everybody, David here. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to do a basic drum beat with your mouth. All right, so we're going to learn three sounds total. We're going to combine them together to do a drum beat. We're going to start out with something that some of you may already be familiar with, which is the boots and cats method. All right, it's a great way to get started, and then we'll uh, dive in a little bit more in depth after that. So, basically, for anyone who isn't familiar, we're just going to say boots and cats and boots and cats. Say that with me. Boots and cats and boots and cats. Doesn't really sound like a drum set yet. Let's get rid of some of the vocalization, make it a little bit more whispered sounding. Okay, like this. Boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats. All right, repeat after me this time. All right, great. And so uh, what we're gonna do is gonna break that down, find out exactly why it works, and see if we can make it a little bit better. So the boots at the beginning, we're gonna start with the first half of that word. That's acting as our bass drum, the B, boo, boo, boo. And so we're gonna hone in on that a little bit. What we want is uh, just a strong uh, kind of consonant with the lips. All right, so you can notice I'm not doing any vocalization of it. I'm not giving any breath to it. I'm not doing like a buh, buh, buh. It's just with the lips. Repeat after me. All right. So we've got the first half of boots. Let's look at that second half. Boots, boots. So we've got a TS sound. We've also got this at the end of cats. So what that TS is doing is acting as our hi-hat. And this one should be pretty simple, so just repeat after me. For anyone who doesn't know, the hi-hat are the cymbals that sit on top of each other at the drum set. You've probably seen them before. They can also be operated with a foot pedal. So when you push down on the pedal, they close. When you release the pedal, they open. And uh, what that allows for is uh, some sustain on the cymbals. So when they're open, they ring a little bit longer. The way that we're going to emulate that with our voices is just to add a little bit of a longer S on the hi-hat. So repeat after me. Great, moving along, we've got our boots taken care of. Now how about our cats? The start of cats, the first half, ka, ka, that's acting as our snare drum. Ka, ka, ka. So you can notice anytime we wanna to try to make it sound a little bit more like a drum, we're gonna take out some of our vocalization of it. Ka, ka, that sounds a little too human. We're gonna make it a little bit more whispery. Now let's see if we can make it sound even more like a snare drum. We're gonna do what's called the P snare. It's a very common sound in beatboxing and vocal percussion. We're gonna picture a P F. It sounds like this. Okay, and this one can be a little tricky. It can take a while because you have to build up those lip muscles. The P is the sound of the stick hitting the head of the drum and the F is the sizzle of the snare. So I don't know if you've ever looked at a snare drum, but on the bottom there's these metal coils, and that's what gives the drum that sizzle sound. So we're gonna do that with an F. And so we wanna um, tighten up our lips nice and tight and have a big explosion of air. All right, don't get discouraged, this one can take a while. Because, uh, like I said, you have to build up those muscles, get a nice tight embouchure or uh, mouth position. Uh, and sometimes with beatboxing, you have to take it a step further than you think. So you think, I'm already giving it as much as I can. I'm already exploding as much air as I can. I can't get any more pressure. Then you have to just go one step beyond that 
and that's where the sound is, okay? And so now let's put that uh, snare drum with our bass drum. We're gonna start with the ka of cats, that's easier snare drum, ka, ka, ka. All right, so put it with the bass drum, Repeat after me. All right, now the time has come. We're going to put all three of them together, our fully uh, refined uh, boots and cats, refined the next level, okay? And so uh, the pattern is going to be bass drum, hi-hat, snare drum, hi-hat. We're going to do it nice and slowly. Here we go. Now I'm going to switch to the P snare, but if you want, you can keep doing that ka anytime I'm doing the all right, to make it a little bit simpler, or if you want to join me on the piece there, please do. Here we go. Now we're going to start slow, and we're going to speed it up a little bit. Just keep going along with me. Here we go. There you have it, the basic drum beat, the refined next level boots and cats. If you've got any questions, let us know. We'll be happy to answer it. Uh, otherwise, we'll see you later, everybody. Thanks for joining me.